Tata. There we go. Hello. I continue my journey as the awesome wizard, Harry Potter, in the universe. So I'm in my dorm. I'm in the Gryffindor uh, common room. So I'm just gonna, you know, I love this room. So beautiful. So relaxing. But let's continue our adventure and see what the first day at school has for us. And oh, man, this is so beautiful. Look at that. I mean, it's just a, a, a staircase, but I know being in this place, man. I wish I would have had this experience, you know. Like my um, my days as a student sucked. Now, which way is the common room? Which way is the common room? Of course, it's gonna be downstairs, I guess. Oh, hello! <laughs> you know this uh, whole thing like with expiration. Oh, nice. So I can actually do Revelio. Revelio. Oh wow. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. Am I actually free to explore as well? Cool stuff. I'll do some sightseeing. I love the murals, the pictures. Mm. And the chandelier looks awesome. I actually jump? Oh, I can't jump. That's upstairs. Let's go all the way upstairs. Can I go inside? Yes, I can. Oh, this is like another room as well. 23. 21. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> a cage for a bird. But I can open, right? I can open the chest there. Level 11 lock? Oh wow. So you need a specific level to go inside, okay. Oh, that's a mirror. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Okay, let's go. There's not much to explore. So I'll just uh, make my way to the room. Ah, there's the mages. I like how they move, you know, in the pictures. There's something cool about that, seeing like people moving in the photo. It's, uh... Oh man, the, the, the game is really cool, you know, like the graphics and even like how the way it goes on stairs. Like these details, I love them, like just to be impressed. These games are so cool, like even the movements are so cool. It feels like real life. Like it's gorgeous to be playing video games these days. Not like before, like everything was so pixelated and so sad and so artificial looking. Now it's like you're actually feeling being there. To, to be honest, can you imagine if I'll ever have more money, I'll just like make sure I'll put my, uh, I'll connect my laptop to to the television and like use it on the big TV because that would be awesome to just be able to play the game on the big TV. I know, I know, rumors, rumors. Everybody's talking about me. The ladies are talking about me. Hello, ladies. Can I talk? Can I flirt? Can I? Uh, both of you are super cute, so uh, I'm probably gonna get arrested for that. So anyway. Um, oh yeah, there was something there, right? Can open the lock. Oh no, it's still level one lock. Okay, so I can't open. I find my way and I go to the room. Hello. They're lucky they didn't end up as dragon food. It's like that poor man from the ministry. Can't imagine starting a new school this late. What? Why not? I'm a genius. Cresida Garrett and Nelly. Cresida Garrett and Nelly, okay. I have to introduce myself, but first I'm just gonna uh, breathe the air of uh, British uh, Oxford type Cambridge. Um, that girl thinks she can get away with it. A professor could arrive any moment. Professor, professor. <laughs> okay. That's a cool, cool guy. Shame you weren't born with wings, Nelly. That girl I'm thinks sure she can get away with anything. <laughs> If I get caught, I shan't defend you. Why would Black want to be headmaster oh. of Hogwarts? 
She gets bolder cool. every I'm year. Sure. Okay. The professor catches her this time. Perhaps something else about. It's nice to listen to the people, you know. Chatting. It'll be the next butterbeer. Oh, it moves. Oh, <laughs> it moves. <laughs> I like Rebellion. the way it Rebellion. Lumos. Lumos. Nobody cares if I activated a spell, right? Protego. 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 I like it. Trust me. Lumos. Protego. I can even attack. Nice. Well, you know, I think that's part of the game. So what are you doing? Sure you <laughs> oh, I can eat an apple. I can eat an apple. Gosh, everything is so detailed. You know, it's just like gorgeous to look at all the details. Don't fall off this time, Nelly. <laughs> the books. The wall. The people. I don't want to get in trouble the first Who day. Who does think she is, anyway? Shame you weren't born with wings, Nelly. I'm sure you use this. Nelly, please get down. I hope a professor catches at this time. Let's go to Nelly. Nelly, I want to speak. Oh, let's talk to Nelly Oxbury. <laughs> Why is everyone so highly strung? It's perfectly safe. <laughs> well, hello. Don't mind me. I find it helpful to change my point of view now and again. Put things in perspective. Once I made it to the top of Gryffindor Tower, from the outside, without a broom. Goodness. <laughs> I'm Nelly, by the way. Nelly Ogspire. I've heard rumors about what happened to you on your way to Hogwarts. Is it true? About the dragon? Yes, I'm a champion of the dragon. Yes. It was terrifying. It was nothing I couldn't handle. Okay. Uh, it was nothing I couldn't handle. Well, really, I didn't handle anything, so it's true. Yeah, let's go. Yes. Our carriage was attacked by a dragon. Crikey! I can't believe it. How thrilling! And also terrifying. Anyway, you've certainly brought some much-needed excitement to Gryffindor. And Hogwarts, for that matter. Eh, nice to meet you. Okay, now what are people saying about my travels here? What exactly are the rumors about my journey to Hogwarts? Uh, that you escaped a dragon attack? <laughs> Isn't that enough? Most of us arrive via train or boat. <laughs> Not having just escaped the jaws of a dragon. Of course it's got people talking. Word travels fast at Hogwarts. I take it you're not afraid of heights? Hmm, it's something I've always done since I was little. My mother once found me on the roof when I was five. Still has no idea how I got there. But with all the strange hallways and rooms in the castle and everything lurking in and outside the grounds, you don't need to scale a tower to see something incredible here. True. What exactly are No, 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 my, my bad. Uh, that you escaped a dragon attack? <laughs> Isn't that enough? Yeah, yeah, Most I know. of us arrive via train okay. or boat. Not that um, word. Okay. I'd imagine most students have never seen a dragon. Have you? Goodness, no. And I'd never heard of one attacking a carriage like that. Not enough meat in a carriage, I'd think. I'm sure I'll be seeing you around, either in our common room or when you <laughs> scale your next tower. <laughs> you never know. Bye for now. Well, if you want to see dragons, uh, play Yu-Gi-Oh! Blue Eyes White Dragon. That's a nice deck. I sent an anonymous howler to Duncan Hobhouse last I like that, this it wizard type of thing. You, know, you put your, your wizard cape on and you look like Merlin the wizard. Oh, perhaps I should... <sighs> okay, so... Uh, what's up with you? Cressida Bloom. I speak with girls. Let's flirt. Flirt. Harry Potter I don't girl. Know what I'm doing wrong. It's not a complicated spell. I should be able to do it non-verbally. Why is this not working? Ugh! Oh, hello there. Welcome to Gryffindor. I'm Cressida. Pleasure to meet you, Cressida. Splendidly theatrical arrival to the sorting ceremony last evening. Made it in by the skin of your teeth. 
Is it true that you're Professor Fig's protege? Uh, no. No, I, I merely studied with him briefly before we arrived. Blast! I was hoping he might have given you some advice on non-verbal casting. Is that what you were trying to do just there? Oh, yes. Having a spot of trouble. I've mastered the charm using its incantation, but this is proving a bit trickier. A little more practice ought to do it. I practiced all summer. <laughs> I can cast spells more complicated than this one without speaking. What's so difficult about this one? I'm just going to keep at it. Speaking. So you can cast spells verbally, which is like typical, but you, if you're a super mage or wizard, you can cast them without speaking. That would be awesome. Is it really that difficult to cast them verbally? Oh, yes. And if you don't get it just right, the results can be, shall we say, awkward. Once, I tried to cast Depulso non-verbally on a goblet in the Great Hall and ended up launching Professor Sharp's Yorkshire pudding into his face. He was not happy. <laughs> Do most students know how to cast non-verbally? Not at all. Hogwarts doesn't teach non-verbal casting until the sixth year, and even then, many struggle with it. I'm simply trying to get ahead of the game. Wait, the fifth year, that means that you're 11, 12 years old, right? That's pretty much it, like, cause I, I remember when I was in my fifth year of school, I was 11. Yeah. So are these guys 11? They look older than 11. Maybe not. Well, good luck with it. It was nice to meet you, Cressida. You as well. Enjoy your first day. So why do I have to speak with all these people? Here, have a sip. Go on. Carrot Weasley. Sure you don't want to try it? Brewed it myself. Hello. You're the new fifth year. Pleased to meet you. I'm Gareth Weasley. Heard about your travels here. Can't believe it. Glad you and Fig are all right. Is it true that someone from the Ministry was with you in the carriage? Oh, uh, yes. A friend of Professor Fig's. Oh, didn't mean to pry. Nasty business, dragons. Again, very glad you're here. Thank you, Gareth. <laughs> so am I. Are you related to Professor Weasley? I am. She's my aunt. Must be nice having an aunt for a professor. You'd think so, wouldn't you? Aunt Matilda tends to treat me as if I'm a first year. <laughs> Keeps too close an eye on me. It's all a bit suffocating, to be honest. Of Still, course. she means well. And she's an incredibly powerful witch. She'll have your back. Are you having butter beer for breakfast? Hmm? Oh, no. I've been perfecting a recipe I came up with over the summer. I'm almost there. Based on some reactions, it may need a bit more work. Seems you enjoy brewing. Might I assume that you've a talent for potions of all sorts? Well, as I see it, there's little difference, fundamentally, between brewing a modification to butterbeer and a Wiganweld potion. Though, I'm not certain Professor Sharp would make the connection. He doesn't appreciate my, uh, creativity as much as you might think. Well, it was nice meeting you, Gareth, and thank you for the insights on your aunt. Pleasure to meet you as well. Good luck today. Good luck to you, mate. New Gryffindor. Professor Weasley's waiting for you outside the common room. New Gryffindor. I am the new Gryffindor. So you call me the new Gryffindor. You should call me uh, the new student, not the new Gryffindor. Good morning. Hello. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? Yes, I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? 
Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. Oh. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Here you are. That's awesome. That's the way to learn. I would be so amazed to be able to learn like that from a book. Whoa. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Let's see. Take me to the tutorial. This is a unique experience, you know. Not many games this have this way. type of experience of, of being a, a, a student wizard in the Harry Potter universe. Even if it's not Harry Potter, being a student wizard in a school of magic. I've never seen this before in my life. Like usually games start with like a warrior, a mage, a typical stuff like Elden Ring or like, uh, I don't know, um, these RPG games, Final Fantasy. So I usually start with somebody like a warrior, an adventurer, Nathan Drake perhaps, you know? But in this case, you're like a wizard. You're like a school, you're like a student in the school of wizards and witches. That's really original, it's really epic. I mean, Nathan Drake in Uncharted is cool because he's an adventurer. Tomb Raider, Lara Croft, she's also cool because she's an adventurer. But all these guys are adventurers. And here I am a student. It feels different. Psychologically speaking, it's, it's, it's different. I like this game. It, 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 it makes me feel good. And it makes me feel the good. The will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. Oh, yes. And it's like giving me the, the pleasure to feel different, even better than in a Harry Potter game. Because Harry Potter games are after the movies, right? But this one is like open world, so RPG. Well, not, it's not open world yet, but... Wait, can I... Do I have like the map? I haven't seen the map yet. So the big map, I guess I don't have the map. Nope. Doesn't seem as if I have the map. Follow Professor. Hey, Professor. Oh, look at the ghost. There's ghosts I in these walls. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. To your surroundings. Do keep up. Oh, oh I'm, I'm sleepy. I like how the game is like really calm in the beginning. Well, it wasn't calm before because ah, I like the dragon. The guide appears to have some information for you about that painting of poor Barufio. Barufio. Okay, let's see what the painting has to say about. The book has to say about Barufio. Simply cast Revelio on it, and we'll see what the guide says. Okay. Revelio. Do I have? What's? That's whoa. Okay, it seems to be something there, but I don't, I can't make it what? Where like the icon is? Why do I do it right? I don't anything, collect. Hmm. This portrait depicts the wizard Barufio, famed for his brain elixir and as an example of what happens when incantations are impor improperly spoken. Oh, he once said S instead of F and found himself on the floor with a buffalo on his chest. <laughs> okay. A buffalo on chest, so... Field guide challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges appears here. Collect field guide pages in Hogwarts. Okay. Field guide challenges are the only way to acquire experience points or XP. Ah, now I have access. This is your wizarding level. XP earned from challenges increase your level and power. Okay, so I'm level one. Your field guide tracks your current challenge progress. Select the challenges menu to continue. 
Collecting your first guide page, unlock the new challenge category, new challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Select field guide pages to continue. Each challenge has tiers, special rewards unlock at each tier you complete from appearance you to get elaborates. Rewards must be claimed. Come back often to collect rewards you have unlocked. Okay. Seems pretty decent. I mean, once you've played lots of RPG games, then... Oh, so now it's when... Ah! Now it's when the map activates. Flu Flames locations. Awesome. Map. Quests. Attend your first day at Hogwarts. Professor Weasley says she has more to show me. Ah, and that's settings, where I can do all the stuff. Gear, mm -hmm. Hello, handwear, facewear, headwear. Wand handles, Harry Potter. Neckwear, cloaks and robes, outfit, flying mounts, cool stuff. Inventory. Quest, collections, challenges. Field guide pages. Collect two field guide. Okay, locked challenge locked. Makes sense. It's the same. Oh yeah, it's oh yeah, and so the start the start button is this one. And then the other one the gate takes you to the menu. Cool. And let's go to the professor. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that. Inside and outside of the castle. Oh, ah, this is the menu of the magics. Okay, I have uh, Lumos to see in dark areas or solve puzzles that require extra light. And that's pretty much the only one I know, Lumos. Mm, essential. Basic cast, essential. Revelio. Ah, so these are essentials. Ah, and then the other ones are like... Like, uh, more like special. Protego essential. Yeah, stupefy essential. Yeah, so I have like for uh, basic cast to attack, to, to reveal stuff, to protect myself and to stun. So that's like basic, basic everyday stuff. And then the other ones are like special. Lumos. Lumos. Do you actually speak? <laughs> I like to do that. <laughs> uh, hey. No time to waste. You've classes to attend. But I like the cat. Oh, I can't just leave the cat. Although it looks more like a cat. Tiger. Bye bye cat, it was nice to play with you. And the cat follows me. You follow me cat. Follow me cat. One eyed witch passage. I like how the people interact by themselves. Ah, yeah. Good timing perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker flu your flame. field guide contains a map of the castle open it up and find central hall central hall a flu flame fast travel point a flu flame you can open the map at any time to fast travel to any discover flu flames okay let's open the map central hall hogwarts is divided into two main areas the left side of the map is where students and professors live and includes the house common rooms and the great hall. Okay. I select the south wing region to continue. South wing, that's the south wing. In this view you can see the flu flames available in that region. Green flu flames represent flames you have discovered including your own house common room. Gryffindor, common room and faculty tower, okay. 
Uh, grave flames that reveal the location of undiscovered flames. Return to map. The right side of the map is where you'll find academic points of interest, including the astronomy tower library and greenhouses. Select the library and next region. Has unlocked the central hall flue flame for you. Okay. Use R to rotate the map and fast travel to the central hall of flue flames with X. Central Hall. Central Hall. I was a bit expecting of the castle to be something like more, I don't know, more shocking to the eye, like Game of Thrones type of style. I mean, this one looks okay, but it's not really that shocking. It looks more like a big house but I would still enjoy to be there to be honest and here we are quite the time saver these stairs lead directly to central hall de -de -de. you can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from central hall uh, yeah, that's why it's called Central Hall, right? Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. I see a dragon. As a model, I used to feel I had a lot of work. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Hmm. You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. Mm. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butter beer there with friends in due course. Butter beer. <laughs> what will I learn in charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day. And you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. There is, in fact. Um, okay, come on, what should I say? Okay. We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and... I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well... I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. <laughs> yes, you seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. 
Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Field guide's map. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Okay, lots of dialogue. A bit more than I would uh, expect, but... Thank you, Professor. Thank you. I need to be really charming with professors. Every time I'm there, everyone falls asleep. Okay, let's uh, go to Professor Fig. And let's see what else expects. Well, I see a flying book there. Come here. No. Revelio. Nice. I see everything. Let's see, Professor. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? <laughs> yes, sir. But I didn't tell her anything else about her travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guides map? Unfold it and have a look. Open quest log. You can check out a quest from the map. Open map. So what's my quest? Okay, the symbol represents main quests. Completing main quests will further the story. Ah, okay. So that's the main story quests. Unlock new features and ungrant XP. So that's the further the story, the main quest. Uh, continue. Some quests are locked by spell and or level requirement. Uh, in these cases, you will need to be the required level. Or spell to activate the quest. Professor assignments or as quest rewards. Okay. Track a quest with A to continue. Defense against the dark arts class. Charms class. I see. Well, Levioso and Nacho. I'll go with the art dark arts. Uh, the field guide map shows Professor Hecate's class in the lower section of the astronomy wing. I could get lost in the castle. May need to use the charmed compass in the field guide to help me find a way. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead. What with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Attend defense against the dark arts. Okay. Quest complete. Welcome to Hogwarts. Cast charmed compass. Will lead you to anything you're tracking. Ah, Charmed Compass. Uh-huh. 
<laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> I like that. Boom. Gosh, I like this magic thing with the lights and the dust. Am I supposed to open that door? Rebellion. Oh, it opens if I... Okay. Now it opens. So, why didn't it open before? Ah, I have to push against it, okay. Makes sense. Oh, I like that. So it keeps on going forever. I actually thought... Ah, so it's like a straight line that always guides me. I thought it was like disappearing, but it's like once there, it guides me all the way. That's awesome. That is beautiful. Flu flames location. I have a flu flame there. Hello, flu flame. What are you up to now? Oh, uh, nothing, ma'am. I'm just. Uh, at least I discovered it. So. Gosh, this is big. Big castle. Uh, you can truly get lost. This is amazing how they did this. Like it's like the easiest way to go somewhere. I wish Final Fantasy and other games would have this, because on the other games you just have to rely on the map all the time. But this one you just don't care about the map anymore. You just like go. That quest to begin. Those eyes are like super scary. Hey. Another flu flame. I like the floor. Is that uh, Bach? I think it's Bach. I mean, no, maybe it's Mozart. Oh, <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> na, 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 na. That's cool. I like the singing. Gosh, this castle is so full of everything. Magic. But I'm not going to get lost now in the castle because it's too much. Gonna go. Uh, I have to go back up. Okay, I went down and back up. Hey, there's something there. Revelio. Quest. Let's go to a. Actually, let's save the game. Uh, first. Side quests are now available. Available side quests can be found inside regions of Hogwarts marked as that, as a black flag. Discover by exploring the world. These quests reward XP but do not advance the main story. I see. I see. The library annex. So that's like a. So these are like the annexes. But these are like black flags. There's one there. So side quests and main story. So Okay, so the main story is these. Oh, that's a quest. Oh. oh my gosh. Makes you a bit sleepy. Um what are doing settings and save. I wanna see if I can save the game. Yeah I can. Manual save. One hour. Defense against. 
save complete. Okay, well, before I start the quest, since this is like a new quest, I'm, I'm gonna do it in the next gameplay. So I'm gonna start a fresh new quest to, to defend myself. Until next time.